I would also add that Malaysia's Prime Minister, Mr. Anwar Ibrahim, was recently in Australia attending, participating in an Australia ASEAN summit, at which, in answer to a question, he pointed out that Malaysia, unlike many other countries, um, from where the questioner came, which is essentially the Western country, Malaysia does not view China as a threat. The perspective is so very different. Um, I believe that countries in this region, ASEAN region, and wider Asia, Asia um, have had diverse historical experiences with encounters with many Western countries who were imperial colonial powers, extractive and exploitative, um, sometimes brutal and ruthless. And they've also had encounters with China, historically, civilizationally, commercially, culturally, and politically. And the ranges of experience are so different that these countries find themselves drawn to a model of economic development, which is peaceful, uh, as the Chinese say, win-win, which is mutually beneficial and equal, uh, mutually respectful. That is the model various Asian countries are attracted to. And that is why, although we see a lot of Western sanctions and tariffs being imposed on China, Asian countries see things very differently indeed. So you can already see a divergence between how Asian countries approach China and other countries from the global north approach China.